We're at Alkbra. You can just see the river in the distance there, which I'll have a look at in a bit. But this is a maze. It's Julian's Bower. I'll read this to you very quickly because uh, it's quite difficult to read, uh, probably on screen. Mazes are associated with the legend of Theseus threading the Cretan labyrinth to slay the Minotaur, a common theme in ancient life. Turf mazes often bore the name of Julian's Bower or Walls of Troy. It is supposed that these names record the belief that Julius, son of Aeneas, legendary founder of Rome, brought maze games to Italy from Troy after its sacking by the Greeks. Maze patterns were adopted by the early church as a symbol of the Christian path to salvation and may have been used for penitential purposes. Because of the likeness to a maze pattern in medieval French churches, it's been suggested that Julian's Bower was first cut by monks from Walcott. In, Elizabeth, in Elizabethan and Stuart times, turf mazes were used for sport on the village green and hedge mazes were a common feature in gardens. Julian's Bower, which is one of the few remaining turf mazes in Britain, was first recorded in 1697 when it was thought to be Roman, but its real age and origin still remain unproven. Julian's Bower, an ancient monument under statutory protection, is privately owned and maintained by voluntary effort. Please respect it. Altbra Maze Committee. And there we go. So I'll just have a walk around so you can actually get a better picture of it. And then we're going to have a look at the, uh, the rest of what's around here. Oh, there we go. How lovely is that? Julian's Bower, every day's a bonus.